everyone, welcome back to another episode of Nexomon. Today I got a special episode for you guys because as you can see, I've gone ahead and I've purchased some diamonds, guys. I just couldn't resist. I had to speed up the process for you guys so it's not so boring. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to open up some golden Nexo boxes, see what kind of uh, Nexomon we're going to get. But first things first, I actually want to purchase some things to actually speed up my gameplay, right? To make it a lot more exciting, to make it a lot more easier for me. So one thing that I wanted to get is this multiplier. Definitely get that right there. So boom, multiplier. That's pretty much going to give uh, experience to all of my Nexomon, the same experience. So they all will uh, level up easier and faster. Attract rare Nexomon, Nexo Charm. That one I kind of like. I'm going to get that one too, right there. But now, I'm not sure if I really want the Repel Spray. Repel all wild next month. So this one doesn't make any sense. <sighs> right? Because I just bought the one to attract rarer ones. So this one's going to repel them. That doesn't make any sense. So I'm not going to purchase that one for now. The avatars are pretty cool looking. Uh, but there's nothing that I like that much. Plant. Wind. I mean, I'm all about fire. That's my thing. I'm... Fire types are my favorite. So maybe I should go with the fire one. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to purchase the fire one <laughs> right there. And then the rest of it, I already purchased the pet. And I guess, I think pets are not released in the game because the pet that I purchased, I can't find them anywhere. And, and I haven't seen anywhere where pets are released. So they're not released yet. So the rest of it, we're going to actually use on opening up some golden uh, Nexo boxes. So let's see. Can I open like three of these? Maybe we'll no, I don't think so two of them So two new rare Nexo mon. Let's hope I can get something pretty cool that we can use on our journey, All right? So here we go guys first pull come on. Give me a dragon something awesome looking What the oh my god, are you kidding me right now? Cragodilo Cragodilo that is exactly what I didn't want that looks hideous Oh, all right. Next one, guys. Actually, I could open two more, so nice. This is good. We got one more after this one, but let's go. Come on, something cool. I want to use this one. Ah, all right. Luberg. That one doesn't look so bad. Is this water type? Ooh, what kind of type is this? So add to the party. Nice. I like that one. One more, guys. One more. Last one here. Let's see. Can we get something cool here? Let's go and open Nexo box. Come on, give me something cool. Oh, yes. Wait, Axe Punk. What? I feel like this is the evol evolution of the first one. Hmm. That one looks like it's the evolution of your starter. The skunk one that we talked about in episode one. Wow. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. <laughs> so that's not that great. All right, I'm pretty sure you can catch all these um, Nexomon in the wild, guys. You don't have to spend any money on this. You can catch them all in the wild. I kind of just wanted to go ahead and, you know, speed up my process here so uh, it could be a lot more exciting. But let's see which ones I'm going to use, which ones I'm not going to use. So already at the bottom, I can already tell Kragodilo and Lombard Luberg. They're rock. They're both ground types. So I'm going to take a look at which one is better, but I feel like I'm going to go with the wolf. The wolf, wolf, wolf one. Rareness, rare. Speed 4, attack 27, stamina 130. That's pretty good. Hmm, let's see some of his skills. Skill as. Actually, you can't even look at the skills. You can only activate them here. Let's take a look at our boy, Luberg. Mega rare, how about that? Ooh, nice. Type mineral. What is, oh, mineral is ground. 28 attack, 4 speed, 4, 11. All right, that's it. I'm keeping him. This guy, I'm going to... I'm not going to release, but I'm going to send him to my box, guys. Let's take a uh, X-Punk here. X-Punk. <laughs> That's a funny name right there. 4 speed, 27 attack. Stamina. He is special, which means he is one of the starters. So that is him. So special ones are one of the starter guys, as you can see. Volo Kitty is also special. So I might keep him too. So we'll keep the fire ones. We have a wind here, mega rare. And we have a mineral here, mega rare. So two mega rares. I'm going to get rid of Biron and the Krakodilo. So I got, I'm going to need a water one. And uh, I'm also going to need one more type. Which one am I missing? A grass probably. Yeah, I'm going to need a grass type. So, so, so far so good. I'm kind of excited about this team 
it's shaping up pretty good but now guys i'm going to go ahead i'm going to train these guys up right now i gotta train them all really good and then we will go on to the battle and see if we can uh, defeat that gym leader once again all right guys so i spent the last couple of days training up my team so i'm going to show you what's been going on since my last video so let's take a look here so this is the progress of the team so far Luberg 10 level 10 fabio level 9 um, Velo Kitty, I'm keeping all those guys, guys. The problem is, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep the bottom row, guys. X Punk, this Felucius right here, I'm kind of digging though. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm liking this guy right here a lot. He's normal, he's a mega rare. Uh, if you don't know what the, the difference is between the rareness, they have a few different types. The, the, all the starters are gonna be special, all right. So if you take a look at the starters, so this guy is a special right here because he was a starter. They have six different, six. They have seven different types in here. They have a normal type. They, as you can see, they have a mineral, which is the rock, uh, you know, ground type. They have a wind type. They have electric type. They have fire. They have water. They have grass. So six, seven different types here. Uh, obviously, I can only use six of them. So I'm gonna keep one of each type except normal, unless I want to keep this this one right here, mega rare, which is great. It's uh, it's got three evolutions. That's why it's a mega rare. And I'm digging it. I'm liking it a lot. And I'm. I think I want to keep this one. It looks pretty cute, but I'm not really sure, guys. For now, I'm going to keep all these guys, and then I'll make adjustments as we go on to the series, all right? So here we are right now. We're back in the town. We are about to go over and challenge the gym leader once again. And this is no ordinary gym leader, guys. This is literally a gym leader. He owns a gym. He's been working out all day on his muscles. So if you are excited about this, guys, don't forget drop a like uh, you guys have been really supportive so far i'm loving all the support that you guys have been showing me for this game and we're gonna keep going on the series here because it's been pretty fun and this is literally pokemon for your phone guys that's all it is it's a different type of pokemon but it's exciting though you don't want to play the same generic games all the time you want to just switch things up and i'm enjoying this game as a kind of a time killer it sucks that it's not free to play but I'm kind of not mad at it, guys. It's only like three bucks to get the game. You don't have to spend any more money on it. And uh, the developers, I'm sure they spent a lot of time building up this game. So it's pretty cool. So far, check it out. We got Luberg here. And Luberg has gotten a new move. This is a um, Sandstorm ability here, which is pretty cool. Because he is ground, after all. Not affecting electric. Does not affect us that much. Sandstorm did 19. Let me see what these other ones are going to do. Let's see what Bite is going to do here. 22. Ooh, Bite is stronger than the Sandstorm. Because, I don't know why, but my opponent's probably not that tough. And Rock Throw. Bam, done deal. Luberg is a lot stronger now. Now we have uh, Vulazy. Vulazy, take some of that Sandstorm. Boom, right there. Ooh, do I want to let him die or should I switch up? Let me see if I'm going to switch up here, guys. Let's switch up to... Faviola! Faviola! What the hell? Oh, I thought it... Ooh, I was about to say, I thought it didn't switch, but it actually did switch here. So, Faviola is pretty cool. It's a wind hero, but it's also got this electric ability here. Check it out. It's just storm. It's not even electric. It's storm. I'm not even sure if it's an electric ability or if it's a water ability. Petrify. Now, the thing that I don't get is when you, dis when you defeat a hero, a new... I mean, uh, when you defeat a Nexomon... The next next one that comes up directly attacks you right away, which is kind of strange. But well, it's not effective. It is an electric ability. So Storm is an electric ability here. Let's go ahead and use this one here. Howling Winds. This one is very effective. So, so Wind is super effective against Mineral, guys. Uh, mineral, like I said before, is a... It's Fly, pretty much. It's, it's Flying ability. So this is his last, fourth and last next Nexomon. Trimion, and he's a normal, you know, normal Nexomon, which is okay. Ooh. Can I defeat him with this? Thirty-one, beautiful, bam, Fabiola, you're a beast. I love Fabiola, guys. Look at all these level ups here. Great. So Fabiola, level ten. Look at the boost that you get right there. Those are all nice boosts. Stamina stayed the same, but attack went up. Nice. Exopunk. Look at this, from 7 to 8, Lucius, there we go, new ability, beautiful guys, so we are on our way, we defeated our first gym, Sha! now let's see what he's gonna do, what the hell, whoa, I love the language, even my bodybuilders left, huh, 
That's what happens when you got fake friends. Fake friends are not good friends, guys. Now tell us all you really know about Nexo Lord. So don't forget this was the goal of this whole uh, journey to Ivan. We need to find out more about the Nexo Lord. That creepy looking dude. What? Do you really think the Nexo Lord tells us his secret plans? Uh, no, I don't. You're an idiot. Overseers are nothing but grunts to him. He let me rule this petty town as long as I shut down anyone who opposed him. See, I have no idea what his schemes is. Okay, what? We beat you for nothing. <laughs> well, I suppose I could tell you about the champions. Ooh, this looks like a good plan. The champions? They belong to the next lord's inner circle. Why superior then overseers? Whoa. Interesting, where can we find the champion? Yes, Ivan, where can they find us? Whoa, what is this? Gulp! If you don't know what gulping is, who said that? Whoa, it's the champion! Fenrir. So this guy looks like he's a fire champion. What are you doing here? Hello to you too, Ivan. Wow, is it me or do these guys look exactly like? What the hell, are they brothers or something? It's a wonderful day to check on my favorite overseer. But lo, but lo and behold, a kid has beaten the almighty Ivan. A kid! I am speechless. Wow, he's not happy. <laughs> this guy's got a dumbbell on his hand. Why don't you just punch him with it? <laughs> You're not supposed to talk about the champions. They beat me! I had no choice! Wow, what the hell is this guy's ability? Silence! On my authority as Fen Fenrir, the champion of fire, you shall be terminated as an overseer. Oh shit, what? What? He's gonna take away his job. You know what? I don't agree. On my authority as the great Ivan, I shall terminate you! <laughs> I love that line. Take this! Dumbbell punch! Oh my god! Oh! You suck, Ivan! What's wrong, Ivan? I don't seem to be determined. Hey, um... How about we go home? <laughs> I like that idea. What is this? Cornered! Uh oh, they cornered us. I heard you got some questions to ask a champion. Go ahead, kids. Ask away. Gulp! Mm. How's it going? <laughs> That's a good question. Um, how's it going? Hey, don't ignore me! Oh, Ivan is still around, guys! Ignoring you? You were literally unconscious! Hey, that didn't even hurt, fire kid. Oh wow, Ivan's got some balls. Here I come again. <laughs> oh my god, he freaking sucks. Cha! Yep, he sucks, guys. He's terrible. What are you kids so afraid of? You beat an overseer. You're really not worth wasting my time on. I see why did the uh, Nexo Lord let you go. I can see why. Damn it, my reading sucks. You know what? Do whatever you want, kid. You're letting us go? Would you rather not? It is an overseer's job to get their hands dirty, not mine. So what the hell does he do? And now, out of my way! Wow, this dude sounds... Sounds crazy, guys. So, a new plot to the story opens up, guys. So, it looks like there's a bunch of overseers that probably run everything. And then, above those are the champions. Kind of like the Elite Four and the Champions League and Pokemon. So, we probably have to beat the overseers. And then, we'll probably have to, you know, then we get a chance to beat the the champions. I'm thinking that's how it goes. Uh, what the hell? You're still around, Ivan? You suck. You're retarded. What? That was one of the Nexalord champions. So yeah, if you want to fight him, oh yeah, totally. Look kid, there are a bunch of overseers who despise the Nexo Lord as well. Really? There's an overseer living in the mountains to the east. 
He knows a lot about the Nexo Lord. Well, if you have the guts to ask him, that is. Wow. In the mountains, huh? Maybe we should talk with Ellie. Things are getting a little out of hand, don't you think? Uh, yeah, I agree. Things are getting crazy up in here. What about you? What will you do that you're not an Everseer anymore? Now I can lift! I pick things up and put them down. I will have my revenge on Fen Fenrir. I will work out every single day. The brat won't see me coming. Oh, <laughs> okay. I wish I had that kind of ambition to work out, guys. I stop, I try, and then I stop. Right. We should probably get going now. Okay, so that is the end of chapter one, it looks like, guys. First overseer in the books, Ivan, the great weenie. And then I see something sparkling here. So what is it? Ten diamonds. Ooh, nice. Ten more diamonds. So our diamonds stack is building up. We're at 200 now. Don't really need to use them for anything right now because I already bought everything I needed to buy. So now, there's somebody out here with a wheelchair. Who is it? It's Ellie. Hello. Hey, Ellie. What's happening, buddy? I was on my way to you at last. Told me that... Oh, Atlas told me that uh, what happened with Ivan. This is much worse than we thought. What do you mean? Whatever the next Lord is planning, I think it's gonna happen soon. Wow. So we gotta figure out the what this plan is. How do you know that? A huge signal has been broadcasted from the Nexo Lord's tower just a few moments ago. Whoa. Um, I've been unable to decrypt the message yet, but this is the first time he makes such a huge broadcast. Really? So that sounds interesting. Ivan didn't receive a message, but maybe that's because he's no longer an overseer. The only way to find out is to ask another overseer. Alright, so we know what our job is. We gotta go to the overseer in the mountains. But before we do anything risky, you should heal your Nexamon and buy his supplies for the trip. Okay, so I'm guessing it's probably gonna be a long trip. I will try to decrypt the broadcast in the meantime. Good luck. Thanks, Ali. You are the man. Alright, when you are ready, we can exit this town by heading east. East? I thought you said weast. <laughs> All right, guys. So we've done it. We have beaten this. Oh, what is this? A mysterious, a mysterious message, message has been delivered to all of the overseers. What could it be? What is the next Lord planning to do? Now our heroes must meet with the overseer of the mountains to discover. Coming up with the typing, the truth. Okay, so we know what we gotta do, and let's go ahead and let's do it. And we found an anti-bind. Okay, so these anti-binds, guys, are just countering, you know, the binds. Now, I heard somebody said that you gotta go into your settings to unlock your pet. But I don't see it. Tap the button to activate or deactivate. Or you gotta go to your profile. Oh, now I see it. Okay, guys, I got it now. This is where you kind of activate... Your you can change your avatar by what you have purchased here, and I have this dude right here. So yeah, you can equip your avatar and him. Nice. Oh, I can have him too. Yes, because I bought that. All right, guys. So take a look. We got a fire one, and we got our little pet. Check it out. Beautiful. Woo! -hoo! We got a pet. Wait, that's a girl. God damn it! It looks like a male. For some reason, I thought it was a dude, but it's a girl. All right, guys. We're, we're, I guess we're gonna be a girl, guys. We're gonna be a. Uh, she's fast as hell. Holy moly! She's on skates. Even our pet can keep up with us. But I wonder if the pet actually does anything specific, or he just doesn't do anything at all. So, all right. If we want to go to the mountains, we will have to head in that direction. Okay. I know what east is. It might be dangerous, so recover your party and get supplies before leaving. I don't need no damn supplies. Or maybe we should get them. Just in case. Alright, just in case we'll get them. Let's head over to the Nexoman Center, guys. And heat up, heal up our Pokemon. I mean, our Nexomans. Damn, I'm going to confuse that forever. Is this male? Do we got male? Hey, did you know that you can carry six Nexomon at a time? Yes, we know this. If you capture another one, they will send to your Nexomon. Yes, we know this basic info. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's heal first. Yes, I want to heal. 
And then, should we buy some supplies? Hmm. Maybe I should, because he doesn't sound like there's something healing in the way, or else they wouldn't make such a big deal about it. Usually, when they make a big deal out of something, then it's a for, you know a foretelling for the future, meaning uh, we told you to buy it. Should have bought some potions or something. So maybe I can purchase some things here. Let's see. Super potion, max potions. How many do we have? We got 5,600. All right. So let's just uh, let's see. some revives. Max revives? No, we don't. We don't need max revives. I'm gonna buy a few revives here. Let's buy three revives. Buy. And then let's buy some potions. Super potions at this stage, I think, should be enough. Three potions. Yeah. We don't want to buy anything just yet. Because our coinage is very low, guys. So it's onward and upward. To the mountains. Let's get going. We are going to the mountains. To face the next overseer. I wonder what type of Nexoman they're going to have. I wonder what level they're going to be. So many questions. And there's something sparkling here in the waterfall. 100 more coins. Nice. Give me them coinage. So let's go, guys. There's so many workout stuff in this town. I wish I lived in a town like that. Where everywhere you look, there's workout equipment, and they make you want to work out. And, uh, yeah, that would be awesome. So what do we have in this little house right here? Uh, lady sweeping? Uh, good. Good. I like that. Lady sweeping. Uh, they didn't give us nothing. I'm not going to go through the, all the dialogue, guys, guys, because it'll probably take too long. We'll probably just do the big scenes, dialogue, and uh, these little ones I'll just skip through. What's this guy want? There have been some really strange earthquakes lately. Oh, really? All right. Whatever. What's this guy doing here? Go away! That jerk Ivan didn't let me join the gym. He thinks I'm too weak. I'll show him. I like you, kid. Sounds like me. <laughs> he's on his... Dude, he's trying to work out real hard. Ugh. That stupid cave to the mountain keeps getting blocked by rock slides. Ooh, do we need some kind of uh, ability? Hmm, I wonder if we're gonna need... Oh, yep, we do need something here, guys. Check it out. We're gonna need something to open up these rocks. But what is it? Mmm, this isn't good. Obviously. But what's the problem? To get to the mountains, we need to enter this cave. They say some really awful earthquakes have been happening these days. We know, but how are we gonna prevent it? Wait for me. What? I don't know. It is Ivan. Haha, -ha, Ivan to the rescue, guys. He's gonna have some kind of big, uh, powerful attack. Or maybe he's just gonna deadlift all those rocks out of there. What do you want? You need to get through uh, here to have to meet the overseer of the mountains. Am I right? Yes. I will lend you a hand. After all, the great Ivan doesn't work for the next lord anymore. All right, so Ivan is in our squad now. What are you gonna do? Crush the boulders with your bare hands? No, I'm gonna deadlift them. Use my back. Yes! Oh shoot, he really is gonna do it, guys. Wait, what? That's exactly what I thought. Special destruction technique. Really? Muscle apocalypse! <laughs> I was gonna say muscle acopolis. I don't even know if that's a word. It's not even a word. But... Dude, dude, whoa, what is that, dude? That's crazy. This dude literally just smashed all the rocks. Can we have that kind of power along our journey? Because that sounds great. That sounds like rock smash. And they say, wait, hey, hee hee. And they say my 24-7 workout routine is a waste of time. 24-7 working out, guys. Um, That's just stupid. Have you ever heard of overtraining, you idiot? That's just too much, guys. Don't ever do that. Don't ever train more than you should. A couple hours a day, every couple of days during the month. It's fine. <laughs> By the way, the cave ahead is only experienced tamers. A weakling like you will never survive. We we'll just fucking kicked your ass. You do realize we beat you, right? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what I thought. Anyways, you will eventually reach the mount uh, town where you can search the Ramos, the overseer, Ramos. I have met the man a few times in the past. I have no doubt that uh, he despises the next lord as much as I do. Ooh, nice. All right, let's just get going, guys. Let's do this. Time to head for the caves. The caves. Ooh, these caves look awesome. What is that? So this is the passage to the mountains. Yes. 
I detect multiple hostile Nexomon roaming around, so be careful. Whoa, I didn't know you had that kind of capability. Some of them are completely new to you. Be ready to capture them if you want. Mm, maybe we will capture some new Nexomon. That sounds pretty good. Hurry up, let's meet Ramos. Sounds like a plan, buddy. Sounds like a plan. And that's where we're going to leave it off for today, guys. I'm going to stop the video right now. I think it's been long enough for now. So we did a lot of good things. We got a revenge on Ivan. We caught a bunch of different, uh, you know, Nexomon here. The team is shaping up pretty good. I'm halfway there. I think I need to get three more. Hello? Hey, what's up? Hey, Julius! Hi, beautiful boy! Hey. Are you guys watching the Super Bowl? Huh? Yeah, I'll come. What time does it start? A onesie? Call, call me and then show me his drawer and I'll tell him what to get. Alright. Alright, babe. Alright. I'm in the, I'm just gonna finish recording. Okay. Alright, love you, bye. Love you. So the team's shaping up pretty good. Uh, the top three uh, next one on there, I'm gonna keep all of them. The bottom three, I'm not too sure about. I really, like I said before, I like Fleecius. Fully she is. <laughs> and uh, we will take a look and see what's going to happen in the series, guys. All right. But for now, I'm going to end it off here. I will catch you guys on the next, next one episode. Till then, have a good morning, good afternoon, and good night.